Hey everybody, I hope you're doing okay. Um, sorry, it's been a little while since I posted a video. I still have, I know I still have one recent one I need to post, but um, I still wanted to go ahead and make this video. And I think I'm, unless I feel like it, I may just do one video a week for the ECT treatments now. Um, and so this video will be for the 15th, 16th, and 17th ones, which were this past Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I um, still have a little makeup on, if you can't tell. A little bit of a light smoky eye from the Naked 3 palette. Although it's getting pretty worn. I went out with my parents and my husband for my birthday dinner tonight since um tomorrow's my birthday the 24th yeah the same birthday is jim parsons from the big bang theory which is pretty awesome but um so we, my dad took us out to dinner and because he's not going to be here tomorrow so he went ahead and took us out tonight so I actually put a little makeup on, which is, it's about, uh, it's about worn off by now. But, it's the first time I've actually done pretty much a full face of makeup in quite a while. And I have a few little face demons coming through, if you can't tell. But, anyway, um, the treatments, I believe, are still going okay. And, um, okay, it's midnight and there's a bird outside my window in a bush. Okay, sorry, getting easily distracted right now. But, um, Monday the seizures, I had two. They did, two, I guess they did two every day this week, as far as I know they did. Um, I know that Monday they were both very brief they didn't even I wasn't given a time limit on those um, I just know that they were very brief and then um, Wednesday it totaled I think 35 seconds and then Friday I think it totaled I believe 41 seconds I'm not sure exactly what they're doing but the doctor seems to be getting the seizure time up which I guess that's his goal is to get that seizure time up a little bit so um, I, I guess that's the goal I'm not sure I'm not sure exactly how they're doing it I know like Wednesday and Friday um, I'm actually kind of wondering if they gave me more, maybe gave me more ketamine or something because of the fact that they were just both so short on Monday, but I don't know for sure. Um, because I know like Wednesday night I got, uh, extremely chilled all over, um, and it's like it moved, started with my feet and moved up my body. And I was, I don't think I have ever shivered so hard in my life. And I was crying because I could not, I couldn't catch my breath. I was crying and I could not get warm. My mom ended up just covering me up and sitting with me. And I was just like, all my whole body was just almost like the muscles were all seizing up because they were so, I was just so so incredibly cold um and I'm not sure exactly why that happened but it did um my mom finally I got her to put my heating I had a heating pad in my bag and um, my mom put my heating pad over my legs and just kept me really warm. And finally I did rest and I was really sore on Thursday. Um, from just the, all the shivering and the 
cold and the just the chilling and all that it, I was so so sore but I did have a massage on Thursday which felt really really good um I got I had a massage when my mom had acupuncture done and I know we both had about an hour and a half massage which felt wonderful and it was from a and it was from a really good friend of mine um so I I mean I really truly enjoyed it and I needed that relaxation so um and then Friday you know the seizure time lasted a little longer um Wednesday and Friday both I slept a lot and I did sleep a lot on Saturday Pooh Bear stop hey who's chewing on her toenails or something but um I did sleep a lot um, after the the sessions both Wednesday and Friday and then also I slept a lot on Saturday and I slept a good bit today so it's like my body just really needed the rest but I'm having still having a lot of the smell memory kind of things along with like a flash of a memory now but it's still like, it's like, but it's not an actual smell that I get. It's more of a feeling. I, I can't explain it. Um, my psychiatrist at home, my home psychiatrist that I've been going to for a really long time, she said it's probably just from so much going on in my brain and just so much stimulation and all that kind of stuff happening that it's you know probably stimulating that but I'm getting like like I'll just be I'll move like on the massage table the other day I moved and I had like a smell memory or I can just be walking or just turn over in bed and I'll have like it's like the smell memory and the like a flash of a memory and I can't explain it. I don't know how to explain it. I don't know. Um, I've been noticing a few little memory issues. Still nothing major. Uh, I'll, like I'll be getting ready to say something or I will have been wanting to do something like and then I just forget what it was. But it's nothing. It hadn't been anything major yet. So um, I'm starting to have it seems like I'm having a few good hours here and there, a little bit more. Um, I know progress has been really super slow, and I'm wondering if that has to do with the fact that my depression has been so severe for so, so long and had gotten so incredibly severe. Um, but I guess that's, I guess that's really why it's probably taken a little longer um so I'll say that's where I'm at right now and I'm hoping for some more good treatments um let's say I have lost some weight which is really awesome because I've been wanting to lose weight but I'm not trying to lose any but I have been losing some which is a good thing it's really good for my rheumatoid arthritis and Pooh Bear you're gonna drive me nuts if you don't stop okay sorry about that but anyway I better get going and get to bed I have to be to Atlanta at 6 30 in the morning yeah treatment on my birthday but it's part of the process each treatment builds off each other so it's just part of the whole thing Anyway, I hope you all take care, and I will talk to you all soon. Bye.